Meet a man too game to let a tough break get him down, Arthur Gondrell, who lost his left forearm at Eeps. Most men find it hard to pocket one ball with three shots. Watch how Arthur pockets this one. Arthur's setting him up again in case you'd like to win a free drink too. Off she goes. And here she comes for a kiss and a wink at the cush. Now, down the spout for a pot of the red. Arthur'll be even redder if it's a miss. A touch of chalk and Arthur's ready for the Piccadilly Circus shot, or how to make eight of them end up in a dive. Watch them circle and weave. A zebra crossing's got nothing on this. They'll all end in one pocket, or so Arthur hopes. Here's the same trick again. Incidentally, war charities have received over £60,000 because of Arthur's tricks. Not bad, eh, for a one-armed man who refused to stay in balk. As an old soldier, Arthur's used to going over the top. Watch closely, his cue ball will hit the red and go right over the top into White's pocket. The chalk gives him a thirst. Soon he'll have to worry about another sort of cue. But first, he wants to show you how Walter Lindrum startled the world with, remember, the famous nursery cannon. Five hundred and twenty-nine consecutive cannons was Lindrum's record in 1933. But even Lindrum couldn't run a nursery with only one hand. 